So waking up this morning and checking Twitter, I had a, a tweet in regards to Ultimate Alliance 3. This was saying the Deadpool Battle of the Atom skin can be found by completing stage 4 of a mortal war against the Punisher with all team members above 25% health. Sounds really odd, I was fairly certain this was a troll so I actually tried it out and after finishing that 4 stage nothing popped up so I most definitely didn't reply with the, the following gif to the user to then when I actually retired from the next stage to get this screen here. So there we go, the costume was actually unlocked, which I was really surprised about. So props to Gopher Rebel for sending me the initial tip off, thanks very much for that. Now, in order to unlock it, I'll just quickly show you the gauntlet that you want to go for. So this is the gauntlet here, you have to go into the Curse of the Vampire menu and it's level 10 one. So if you've got a decent roster and you didn't start playing the game yesterday, then you should be able to complete the final stage without dropping below 25% with no problem. I don't think I'd drop below 90%, but admittedly my characters are level 300. But this allows you to unlock the Battle of the Atom costume, so let me just show you in-game what it looks like. So this here is the alternative colour, and up until today was the only one available in the game that was via the Shield Depot. Here we go for the, the default colours, and they do look better, but I still think it is a pretty odd looking costume. Let me give it a quick spin. I won't show off gameplay because honestly this is one of the easiest costumes to unlock in the game if it being a, only a, a level 10 gauntlet. But that's the costume there. I hope that go for rebel you didn't see my initial message. I deleted it nice and quick. My initial reply to you. Uh, thanks once again and everyone else stay safe and I'll see you all again soon.